Hello everyone. Welcome to the, to the day of announcements about our latest. I'm Adam Wei from High Target International. And as you can see from the screen, the keyword of today's product launch is Android. What does it mean? Maybe you've guessed. Yes, that means our total station will also be Androidized. Next, let me introduce to you something about our new Android total station. First of all, looking back, Hitachi has always been captivated by Android system, systems intelligence. A decade ago, we pioneered the conversion from the C system to Android, offering a superb experience with a large screen, high resolution, multi-touch, and gesture support. Since then, our Android handheld has impressed. Now we are ensuring total station users also enjoy Android's user-friendly operation. So welcome to a new era of intelligence surveying. In the past, our total stations were equipped with key operation, black and white screens, and a WinC operating system. And our competitors have favored Windows CE system due to their existing infrastructure. However, we've chosen Android from user-centric perspective for its familiarity, user-friendliness, and efficiency. Our goal is to offer you an intelligent total station that enhances productivity and simplifying surveying. So what are the benefits of Android Androidization of total station. I introduce them to you one by one. First of all, let's start with a video. Here is the latest HTS 720 Android station. Our top designers have put countless hours of work into making sure it looks stunning. This is a combination of engineering aesthetics and modern aesthetics. As a new look with a large 5.5 inch display, and it is incredibly solid and durable. So what can our Android Total Station do? I will tell you about it. And also, you, have, you, may have seen, you may have seen some functions in the video just now. First of all, our Total Station with Octa Core have a large memory of 2 plus 60 GB and oper operate very smoothly, unlike others on the market. We've completely redesigned the machine, achieving seamless bus communication for complex applications. No more limitation of wireless or cable connections. Take a closer look at our design. We've kept minimalist physical keys. 
to accommodate extreme working conditions. Imagine winter when wearing gloves make touch screen navigation cumbersome. So we've included a few physical buttons ensuring basic operation and most functions are accessible without fuss. Of course, when conditions allow, we encourage seamless touch screen interactions. Enjoy effortless control in any environment with our user-centric approach. Second point showcases the seamless integration and perfect fit of our entire design. This integrated approach has allowed us to achieve a truly harmonious product. By deeply integrating the Android solution into the total station, rather than just fitting a mobile form into it, we've accomplished, uh, we've accomplished a large screen, millisecond level latency, and, and, exception, and exceptional performances. It's pure, it's pure awesomeness for an unbeatable user experience. Uh, so the first function is CLS take out. Total station users have been craving for years, right? After watching RDK user enjoy this feature, it's finally our turn to embrace its convenience and efficiency and let us watch a video to know how to use it. And Tom has come to 2023, we finally say goodbye to the era of holding city joints in one hand and searching for names in total station with the other hand. Now we only need to import the city file into the total station, display the city join on the big screen, and zoom me into select the stakeout points. Then we also have some hum humanized design such as the nearest edge, the nearest corner, the nearest point of the automatic code capture. And the users like dealing with the internal work as easy as working in the outside. And let's introduce the second function. This function may not have, may not be a very big function, but I think it is a very user friendly function. Perhaps this is the best electrolyte bubble that you have ever used. We call it guided electrolyte bubble. In fact, we're very ty tired when looking at this circular bubble, especially when the light is not good. And even if you see it, you can't level it well. Why? Because we're looking diagonally, and when you look diagonally, when you think, is centered. It is already crooked. This is a physical limitation that pre prevents us from applying these products well. So we deduced that we already have this electronic bubble inside us and it's more accurate. It is more reliable than the tubal bubble and circular bubble because it is more sensitive and it is not susceptible to some external conditions, such as if we do not calibrate, the physical bubble may be crooked. So we developed this feature, and let's take a look at it first with a video. Uh, 
as you can see from the video on the screen of the total station, it can accurately display which screw the user should turn. Of course, the user only needs to do one thing, that is, let a screen align with any two screws, forming a roughly parallel surface. At this time, the software and the sensor will automatically determine which side of the total station is high. The user should turn which screw, which direction to turn. The total station will use arrows to show. Users only need to follow the operation. I think it is a very useful feature, especially for nighttime tunneling or low light conditions. And recently, our engineers are particularly obsessed with camera. And in addition to using it on RDK, they also want to use it on total station. So we've installed a camera in the total station as well. So what can this camera do? It brings two big functions, which I will introduce to you. The first function is to form our electronic sketch. Electronic sketch eliminates the hassles of manual drafting and is more accurate. So let's take a look at a video to see how electronic sketch works. We've chosen a few examples, such as fire hydrants and street lights, and mark the measure points with a yellow cross wire. The next thing I'd like to announce is visual stakeout. This is an incredibly exciting feature that we can't wait to share with you. Traditional stakeout requires the surveyor to hold the road to move back and forth, constantly measuring. Not only the efficiency is low, the surveyor is also very tired. So what do we do? We let as many of these things that need to be seen through the eyepieces directly to the big screen. Users just operate on the big screen unless, unless you have some extremely special, highly accurate last step corrections through the eyepiece. And on a very dark evening, the human eye's light sensitivity is nowhere near what a camera is capable of. In fact, just like we feel that it's already dark, the camera can make it clearer and brighter by taking a long exposure or increasing the sensibility. And Next, we can watch a video to know how visual stakeout function works. Through the video, we can see that the stakeout point is displayed in the real scene. So we already know the exact location of the stakeout point in the display. The users only need to walk to the position indicated by the image. And finally, fire term to determine the accurate location of the stakeout point. So just to mention so many points are some small highlights. The whole total station after Android, it brings the biggest advantage is that it can be loaded with a lot of software. This is our 1.0 basic version of the software. We provide measurements, modeling, tunnels, bridges, highways, and other modules. And these modules are free. In the future, with our contact with users and our mining of industry applications, 
will launch more useful M4 featured software packages. Meanwhile, due to its deep integration with Android, the whole software and firmware can also be upgraded via OTA as long as you purchase the high target Android total station. You can always stay in the latest performance state. Use our latest software package and latest firmware package and the best features. This is the convenience that OTA brings to our life. And from this page uh, is how we think a deeply integrated Android total station for Android can bring the convenience to us. Uh, those can summarize to the guided e-bubble, which makes it easy for users to set up a station and easy for new bits to get started. And the visual stake out function, you can know the location of stake out points displayed on the screen. The imaging of recording points, users do not need to be afraid of bad memory. And we even added the function of automatically calculating the height of the instrument so that users can measure the height of the instruments even if they forget to bring tape measure. At the same time, CAD stake out let every experience the joint of directly selecting a stakeout point from the touch screen. This is the experience that Android's total station can bring to everyone. And Smart Android is on. Thank you for your watching.